So it is official from EA that we are getting team of the season moments in this game in the team of the season section of course right now we've got them in the market as you can see we've got 113 overall royce 113 goretzka is there he's a team of the season moments as well as araujo hyunmin son rich james and a lot of other players as well some people are packing them i'm not quite sure from where they're packing them but i guess from the exchanges or something like that so let me know down in the comment section what type of packs do you think they're gonna give us or are they gonna give us free to play uh, free to play link where we can go ahead and grind for them. I'm not sure. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you're excited though Also, we've got an exchange that you definitely should don't miss out You should do it right now because It's gonna run out very very soon. We've got the team of the season event in the team of the season event Obviously, you should play the community event, the community chapter to go and open these packs as well as Bundesliga chapter right now Let me know down in the comment section. How many points do you have in the Bundesliga chapter? I I miss out I missed out on two on watching two ads here so I got um 120 and I can get 240 for today. Obviously you can watch ads every single 12 hours so that's what I didn't do. But if you did everything right you should have 280 Bundesliga points today. You can go ahead and claim these rewards of course go further in this reward path. Let me go ahead and claim as many of these as I can. 500 gems I'll t I'll definitely take 500 gems from there. And I can claim this one as well. 100 skill balls, not bad, not bad. Also, we've got the team of the season icon section where you can uh, pack some of the high overall team of the season players. Or if you don't want to risk for it, you can go ahead and get 111s, 112s. But also right now, we've got the new hero journey players. Obviously, what if as well. But new hero journey players. You, sh you should 100% do this every single day. As well as you should uh, watch this ad every single 12 hours. I haven't watched this ad. Um, every single 12 hours as well all the time I'm, I miss out on it sometimes but you should definitely play this not only because you're gonna get a lot of hero tokens but also you're gonna get this 105 plus overall master hero player pack as well where you can pack like 109 overall cards yesterday i packed 107 overall now let me go and if it was so i packed so yesterday so that was definitely not a bad pack but also you know the way you can get a lot more uh hero points for uh, claiming 112 overall or 113 overall, of course, 112 overall Okocha, 112 overall Nakata or 113 overall Forlan or Lucio is you need to go into the exchanges. There is a new hidden exchange in Heroes Journey. Obviously, you can open uh, you can open this pack where you can pack Prime Hero player, uh, the new Prime Hero players, but also some icons. But the way you can get new players is right here or new 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 way to get hero po uh, hero tokens is right here you can get 60 hero tokens by putting in 30 95 plus overall uh players now you 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 might think that's a lot you might think that's a lot it's not worth it to go out and do that but you probably got so many 95 plus overall players that are that you are just not using and they're just stuck in your team you should 100 percent do this exchange in my opinion if you if you don't have that many 95 plus overall players either way you can get them for quite cheap. If you go here, for example, I'm gonna search for 97 um, overall and minus. You can get this 97 overall card for like 70k, 60k, um, 90, 94s so obviously are not gonna work. But yeah, there is a Simon who you can get for like one ten thousand coins. There is Koyate there. Let's see how much I can get him for. How many Koyates I can get? Only one, unfortunately. But you can definitely get a lot of these 97s, 96s. Even though a lot of people are trying to buy these cards, you can still get them. You can still get them. Um, th there are a lot of people trying to sell those cards as well. So I would 100% suggest you to do that Heroes Journey exchange. Um, and it's it, it's going away in 39 hours for me, as you can see right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and quick add. As you can see, I'm using all the 95s, 96s, and 97 overall cards for this. And you can do this two times as well. So you're gonna get 120 extra hero tokens from here. Obviously now I don't have any more 95s. I'm still gonna use those 110, 100 overall cards because no, no, not the tradable ones. I'm not gonna use the tradable ones. I'm gonna use the untradable ones. I'm not gonna use back him as well. I don't know why. I want, to, I want to save him for some reason. But I've got so many of these team of the season, oh no, UCL cards that are untradable as you can see. I can just go ahead and put them in, right? I can just go ahead and put them in. One more card, here we go. No problem at all for me. I've got some UELs and some 101s that, that I can also use for this exchange. But that's pretty much it. I can use that, uh, use those 100 overall untradable cards and very, very cheap 95 to 97 overall cards, 98. 
doesn't matter. If you don't use the 99s and 100 overalls, you can basically buy cards from 95 to 97 overall, very, very cheap, and just get extra 120 tokens that way. Uh, let's go ahead and check out how much some of the 95 overall cards are worth. Some people, a lot of people are trying to buy 95s because it says 95 plus, but you can buy the 96 cards, of course. Uh, and it's gonna be almost the same price. There are a lot, or a lot of them that are worth a lot of coins, of course. But there are some that are uh, seven, eighty k. People are trying to buy these cards, but you, as I said, you can still buy them. If you go ahead and uh, hit purchase, you are gonna buy. Uh, you're you're definitely gonna get a lot of these cards. Um, and yeah, there are so so many. You're, you're definitely gonna be able to get enough to uh, do that exchange two times and get 120 extra hero tokens. Um, if, you, if you don't know the way we get hero tokens, how many hero tokens you can get is, is a lot more right now than it was last month. You can still use last month the hero tokens to go and purchase your, uh, your cards if you want. Want in overall, the warrior under 111 overall, um, Cap de Villa Ture or Donovan. Bam. Also, uh, you can use uh, you can use your, use your points to get the new cards as well. One to the overalls are only worth fifteen hundred uh, heroes tokens. Also, if you got some leftover hero tokens from the hero journey one, what you can do is you can go into event shop here in heroes, and as you can see, you can convert your old points, old team list or old hero tokens into the new hero tokens. Yeah, you can convert three of them. Uh, into seven seven new ones so that's pretty nice as well and if you if you want to get the old hero journey players you can convert them back as well you can convert your seven uh, hero hero token two into three hero tokens as well so that's a very very nice touch yeah I have done uh, if you if you I guess are very very close to claiming um, Donovan or um, whatever you want one ten overall the warrior you can convert your hero hero token two you can grind your hero token two players and get uh, get that hero token one player from that. So that, that's nice as I said, that's very, very nice. Other than that, would I, would I suggest you to do any other exchange in Hero Journey chapter? No, not really. And also we don't have that exchange either right now uh, that we had last week where we could put um, some like, uh, we could put hero tokens and an old hero player uh, to get 112 overall for free or 113 overall. Unfortunately, we don't have that type of event anymore. Other than that, I wouldn't really suggest you to do any other exchanges. We are getting the what if event, which is quite exciting, definitely. And in the team of the season section, you should go ahead and grind everything there. And obviously, we've got the quest, we've got the new challenge mode as well. Do not forget about challenge mode, you're gonna get extra 105 plus overall uh, team of the year player, team of the season player pack there and 225,000 coins as well as 125 skill boost. So don't forget about that either. Bam, this is gonna be the end of the video for today. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and peace.